Just been doing a bit of sorting out and whatnot here. Um, I usually keep all the shopping bags that I get when I go shopping and I stuff them all in a single shopping bag which I have hanging off a nail in the room that the solar fridge is in. Um, and you know I get quite a few bags wound up but that's not the only sort of bags I keep. I also keep bread bags and I build all those up into another bag and at the end of the day I take them over and give them to my mother once I've got quite a few which I'll do today. Um, and you may say, well, what's the point of keeping all these damn bags? Well, when you butcher your own meat, usually you go and get a certain amount of chops, um, you know, like steaks, and basically decide, okay, this is about enough for one meal, and you throw them in a bag. And they tend to fit pretty well in these bags. And honestly, you only use up, you know, the last few inches of the bag, and you've tie it off with a bit of string. We've been using blooming uh, wool actually, um, like knitting wool. And then, you know, throw your meat in the freezer and same again and again and again and again. And basically it doesn't sound like a very glorious idea but it's one thing that you don't have to buy at the supermarket um, and, you know, you don't have to think, oh damn, now we're butchering, now I don't have any bags, what am I going to do? You know, because you've already got all these bags and it's just sort of a simple thing of reusing stuff and today's society they throw everything and then go buy something that's just about identical and these you know aren't much difference in size from normal freezer bags anyway and you know for roasts and things like that you can usually fit them in a shopping bag and then you've got all the bags you need to store stuff in the fridge without having bought any bags or worst case scenario forgot to buy bags when you're just about ready to slice all the meat up, you know, and here you are with all this meat sitting there that you've got to get into a freezer reasonably quickly, going, oh, I don't have the bags to get it in there. But that's just a little thing I do for, you know, reusing stuff that a lot of the world doesn't do today, you know, and it's just sort of a um, if we need it, we'll buy it mentality. And it's just more stuff that's bought that you've sort of already had anyway. You know, and so I just uh, stash all this away and use it when the uh, every six months when the time comes, um, we pull out stacks of these, and you know we've got no shortage of bags, and we've never run out of bags ever when we've been butchering, not even once.